I said, what's good, Reamfit Nation? What's good, Reamfit Nation? You guys already know the vibes. And in today's video, I am going to be showing you guys some basic, basic combos. Very simple, very easy to do. Anybody can do it. Any fighter can do it. And it's going to take a game to a whole nother level. Trust me, these basic combos are all I do to get my wins. And I do pretty well, if I don't say it to myself. So without further ado, let's get to the UFC gym. All right, let's go. We are at the UFC gym. We have Tony Ferguson, and we are going to be practicing against George Gamebred Masvidal. Now, let's start off with the basic one-two punch. So that's jab into straight like this here. One, two, one, two. Very, very effective, very fast. One of my all-time favorite combos. It's great on stamina. It's just, like I said, it's my bread and butter when I'm playing. But you, as with anything in this game, you don't want to spam it because it could become predictable and then you would get punished for it. Anyway, now if you want, you can add another punch to it on the end so it'll look like this. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. You know, that's if you want to add another punch. Usually I don't, but if you want to, you can. All right. Now the next combo I want to show you guys is the jab uppercut straight uppercut and then the jab straight uppercut so it looks like this jab uppercut jab uppercut jab uppercut and then straight uppercut straight uppercut straight uppercut straight uppercut and now jab straight uppercut jab straight uppercut jab straight uppercut jab straight uppercut very simple and if you want you can flip it so it'll be Straight jab, uppercut, straight jab, uppercut, straight jab, uppercut, straight jab, uppercut. Now, a general rule of thumb is whatever button you hit last, if you want to like experiment and try to make your own combos, you always want to hit the button of the opposite side. So, for example, if the last button I hit in my combo was triangle, you can only hit buttons on the opposite side of triangle. And for you Xbox players, that'll be Y. So if the last button you hit was Y, you want to hit X. Or if you're on PlayStation, the last button you hit was triangle, you want to hit square. Or 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 um cross. Or A. You know? Now the next combo is going to be the jab to the cross. So it's gonna look like this. One, two, one, two. Very simple. All day long, good on stamina. And if you want to flip it, you can. So you can do a cross to a straight. So it look like this. One, two. One, two. One, two. Very simple. Good on stamina. Just you don't want to spam it. Now the next combo is going to be the jab to the cross to the uppercut. So it, it'll look like this. One, two, three. One, two, three. Three, and if you want to flip it, you can. So it'll be a straight cross uppercut like that. Most of the combos you can do in this game can be flipped the opposite way. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, just like that. All day long, like I said, this is another good one. Very good on stamina. Most of the combos I'm going to show you guys in this video are going to be great on stamina. You just don't want to spam any of them. Now, the next combo I want to show you guys is the jab and straight to the body. So it's going to look like this. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. And if you want to mix it up, you can do a straight, you can do a jab to the head and then straight to the body. Or a straight to the head, jab to the body. Straight to the head, jab to the body. Or jab to the head, straight to the body. Or one, two. One, two. Very, very good on stamina. Very easy to do. 
you always want to be mixing up your attacks never want to get predictable but you don't want to spam it especially this any type of body shot if you get kneed in the face you're going to take double the damage and if your head and health is low enough you may get knocked out so you don't want to spam it but just use it as part of your combo just mix it in there like i said one two or straight like that very easy very easy so now the next combo i'm going to show you guys is going to be a jab to the body followed by a cross to the head so it'll look like this very simple and if you want you can mix it up you can switch it up so it'll be a straight straight to the body cross to the head all you have to do is just Anytime you flip it, you want to make sure that you're hitting the opposite of what you did the first time. It's just that simple. Straight. Straight to the body. Cross to the head. Straight to the body. Cross to the head. Jab to the body. Cross to the head. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Just that simple. Very good on stamina. And you could possibly get a knockdown from it. And it's great for mixing up your opponents. Now, the next combo... I want to show you guys it's going to be the jab to the body followed by an uppercut so you want to jab to the body uppercut 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 very simple and it's very good because if you if you condition your opponent to be blocking low they are not going to be expecting the uppercut like at all like, I've caught so many people with this combo, it makes no sense. This game is all about conditioning your opponent. And like I said, if you can get them to continuously block low, this up is a free uppercut. And depending on their head health, that might be a free knockdown. And as always, you can flip it. So it'll be a st straight to the body, uppercut. 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 Just that simple, just that simple, just that simple. Now the next combo I want to show you guys is the crosses to the body. Now I want to apologize for not saying this earlier, but my you see I'm my left hand, your jab hand is your lead hand, and your opposite hand is your back hand, and the same thing for your foot. So I just want to just put that out there. I'm sorry to bring it up earlier. So, this will be lead uppercut, and this will be a back uppercut. Now, your back uppercut always does more damage, and I just want to apologize for not bringing that up sooner, early in the video, but I just wanted to get straight to the combos. Anyway, so, one, two, one, two, one, two, and for those of you, if you don't know how to do it, it's pretty much that you're just holding L1, L2, or LB, LT and you're, you're hitting the punch buttons so one two and this just destroys like the body if you hit them with a couple of these good that their stamina and their body health is going to drop I am telling you guys I've won many fights from just this combo right here very easy one two all day long just that easy and if you want you can flip it just that easy now the next combo I want to show you guys is jab to the body followed by a cross to the body so it's going to look like this jab to the body jab to the body jab to the body cross 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 just like that all day long very good that first jab is fast followed by that that power you know and like I said with every other combo if you want you can flip it so it'll be straight to the body straight to the body cross 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 now your punching power and your punching speed of course it depends on the fighter I, I feel I feel like I didn't have to 
say that, but I just wanted just to put it out there, just in case anybody was wondering, your power speed, your punching speed, pardon me, and your power all depend on your fighter. And some fighters have much better combos than others, but the majority of the combos that I'm gonna show you guys, if not all of them, like I said in the beginning of the video, you should be able to do with any fighter. These are all basic universal combos that, like I said, I feel like anybody can do. So I wanna show you guys a few combos here. So the first combo I wanna show you guys is the jab to the head followed by lead cross to the body, then a straight to the head followed by a lead cross to the body, and then a jab straight followed by a lead cross to the body, and then I wanna show you guys a jab followed by um, backhand cross to the body. So it's gonna look like this here. So jab, jab cross, jab cross the body. Jab body, jab body, jab body, jab body, jab body, jab body. See how fast this is? This is one of like the best combos you can do. This is one of the few combos in the game where you use the same hand for two attacks in the combo, so back to back. So jab to the head, lead cross the body. 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 Now I want to show you guys straight to the head, straight to the head, lead cross the body. Straight to the head, lead cross the body. Same thing. The only difference is you're getting more power, but that straight is slower than your jab. But you do get more power. Straight to the head, lead cross the body. Straight to the head, lead cross the body. Straight to the head, lead cross the body. And now I want to show you guys jab to the head. Jab to the head straight, lead cross to the body. Jab to the head straight, lead cross to the body. Jab to the head straight, lead cross to the body. Jab to the head straight, lead cross to the body. Jab to the head straight to the head, lead cross to the body. Jab to the head, lead cross to the body. Just like that. Very fast, very powerful combo. You can you can easily win fights with this combo. But like I said, just be careful you don't want to spam it. Now, right, you can also flip it. So jab, back, backhand cross the body. Jab, back 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 cross the body. Now, if you notice the difference, it's a lot slower than this. This is a lot slower than this. You see the difference? That is so much faster than this. You see? So, only go for this, in my opinion, right? Only go for this if you know for sure you got them on, like, if you got them at back against the cage and their body health is, like, flashing and they one punch from going down. That's the only time I would recommend you going for that. Otherwise, this is where you want to be. See how fast this is? So much faster. Even with this. Even with that. Even if you add that in, it's still, it's still a lot faster if you try it like this, you can't even do it the other way. The game doesn't let you do it the other way. You can't even do it the other way. All right, now the next combo I wanna show you guys is the lead roundhouse kick to the straight. So it's gonna look like this. Lead roundhouse, straight. Lead roundhouse, straight. Lead roundhouse, straight. Just like that, all day long. Very, very effective combo. When you, when you see your opponent always like walking in like always approaching that is a very this is a very good combo for those type of players that's like when you catch my walking in it's like mm, back up back up get up give me three free <laughs> but yeah man that's a great combo for that just lead round house straight lead round house straight just like that man all day long get them out your face now this next combo I want to show you guys is one of my personal favorites. And if you guys have ever seen me play this game, you guys know that I use this combo very, very often. And it is the jab to the head fo followed by, pardon me, the back foot kick to the body and then straight to the head, back foot kick to the body and then jab straight to the back foot kick to the body. And this combo is very effective for wearing that body down at the beginning of fights. And it's a very, very 
fast combo. So it's gonna look like this. Jab to the head, jab to the head, back foot kick to the body, jab to the head, back foot kick to the body, jab to the head, back foot kick to the body, very fast, very fast. And then, you know, straight, back foot kick to the body, straight, back foot kick to the body, straight, back foot kick to the body, straight, back foot kick to the body. Now, right, when you do it with the jab, that jab is faster. But when you do it with the straight, you get more reach. So look, see how that I'm missing? Now with that straight, I'm gonna get that and then I can still connect with the kick. Or if you wanna um, do a jab straight, you can. Jab straight, kick to the body. Jab straight, back foot kick to the body. Jab straight, jab straight, back foot kick to the body. Jab straight, back foot kick to the body. Now, you can also do a lead kick to the body, but it's a lot slower. Like, you see the difference? You see this compared to this? Look at this. See how much faster that is? See how much faster that is? Now, if you do it like this, it's a lot slower. But you can still do it. It's just going to be a lot slower. See, look. Straight. Lead foot kick to the body. Lead foot kick to the body. Straight. Lead foot kick to the body. Or jab. Lead foot kick to the body. Jab. Lead foot kick to the body. Jab. Lead foot kick to the body. Jab straight. Lead foot kick to the body. Jab straight. Jab straight, leave for kicks to the body. You see the difference? You see how much slower this is? Look how slow this is compared to this. See the difference? Versus, like I said, that back foot kick to the body is always going to be faster than the lead foot kick to the body. So always be aware of that. Now, the next combos I want to show you guys is going to be a jab straight followed by both a lead low kick and then a back low kick. So it's gonna look like this, jab straight, lead low kick, jab straight, back low kick. Jab straight, lead low kick, jab straight, back low kick. Jab straight, lead low kick, jab straight, back low kick. Now this combo is good for if you wanna work on them legs or if your opponent is constantly shifting around the ring like this, you can trip them up very easily and build up that leg damage very quickly. But you don't want to spam it. Yo, listen, make sure you guys write that down. You don't want to spam it. No matter everything I'm teaching you in this video, you don't want to spam it. Now, if you spam these low, if you spam these low kicks, your kicks are going to get checked. And if your kicks get checked, you take more damage. So just keep that in mind. So if you want to throw out these low kicks, you want to make sure you mix them in as part of a combo. Because if you just start spamming them and your opponent get to checking them, you won't be able to walk home, man. Or end up like Conor McGregor. You don't want that. All right. Now the next combo I want to show you guys is going to be back cross, lead low kick, followed by front cross, back low kick. So it's gonna look like this. Lead cross, lead cross, lead cross, lead cross, back low kick. Lead cross, back low kick, lead cross, back low kick. Lead cross, back low kick. Now, I wanna show you guys back cross, back cross, back cross, back cross, lead low kick, 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 just like that. All right, for the final combo in this guide, I want to show you guys lead uppercut followed by back low kick, then back uppercut followed by lead low kick. So it's going to look like this. So lead uppercut, back low kick, lead uppercut, back low kick, lead uppercut, back low kick. Now it's back uppercut, lead low kick. Back uppercut, lead low kick, back uppercut, lead low kick, back uppercut, lead low kick. Just like that, all day long. Very easy, very simple. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this guide, man, please leave a like down below. I can almost guarantee that I left out some combos. So let me know in the comment section what combos did I leave out because there are so many in this game. And I just wanted to go over the most effective and basic ones that I know that I use personally and I know for sure that works. 
So anyway, if you guys are new to the channel, please make sure you guys either hit that follow button or hit that subscribe button depending on the platform you are watching this on. And I definitely appreciate you guys watching it all the way through like this, man. Thank you so much, man. If you made it to this point in the video, let me know in the comment section. Say I made it through in the comment section. And I definitely appreciate it. Anyway, you guys be good like how you be good. Peace.